my next series of lectures will be on Raymond and Raymond Stilges integration integrals okay and the very basic thing many students have problem with uh, this Riemann integral or Riemann Stilges integral even for two reasons first the very basic thing which you require for uh, integration theory is a mastery over the LUB GLB concept as usual in typical analysis course teachers very hurriedly go to continuity etc okay do not spend enough time on LUB GLB properties and how to work with that so that kind of takes a toll when you come to integration because LUB GLB is very important number one number two in Raymond and Dugler, there is a lot of geometry because after all integration theory is something to do with finding the area of some arbitrary regions right it, like if you have a positive function on interval then what you are trying to do you are trying to find the area enclosed by four curves y equal to 0 y equal to fx x equal to a x equal to b okay so you have to find so this is highly geometric many times people write only keep on writing inequalities and uh, gets estimates etc without giving the geometry and it is compounded when you come to Riemann steel just because there you can't even draw picture right so the point I'm going to do is I will emphasize Riemann integral so that I mean, the geometry will become clear and I will say that how the same proof most often works for Riemann steel just okay the inequalities whatever you write is obviously true for Riemann steel just okay and there are two special results which are very peculiar to Riemann steel just that we will do at the end so this is the plan of our course okay so I hope all of you understood